All right, guys, we're going to fly the drone. I know we're jumping in this quick, but we're losing light. It's 8.04, and I decided I want to fly the drone. We still have light. You can see it. It's just dark right here because of the trees. Um, I'm going up to a church. Going to fly behind that, and it's going to be awesome. We're going to get it. I was going to drive ride, ride my longboard up there. You can see. You can't see it. But, yeah, so I still have it. might ride it around while I'm over there, but I'm going to fly the drone first. So, yeah, cut to drone footage now. Guys, I know you can't see me. Um, we're losing light quick. I'm gonna get this set up real fast. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Now I'm throwing stuff. <laughs> All right, guys, see, we still have sun. Jones turned on. We're gonna get it. Put you up here. see me at all but I have to land the drone but there's not enough light so here we go <laughs> like all my things are going off warnings with no light or anything all right guys I know it's like dark out it's 8 22 currently but um the church I was just flying around you just saw like the tip of it is actually a pokey stop and it'll be my first stop of the day um, it'll actually be my number one stop because I've been I've been way off. I had them set for a long time, but if I spin this one day streak, perfect. Uh, and then I want to talk to you guys about something. One thing that I do or try to do. This might be I don't know if this is like a little tip or something. This is something that I do, but it's I for my first catch of the day I try to catch an evolve form because evolve form naturally gives you more. Um, stardust when you catch them so your first catch of the day gives you an extra amount of stardust I'm gonna throw a great ball at him just to get that first catch and got a nice hit him on the head I'll take it and and there we go caught him first catch of the day gives you 900 there are a couple of times where I've caught on a third form which I believe you get 14 or 12 Something along those lines, if you make him your first catch of the day. Like, I think I caught a Butterfree the other day. I just was around. With the Butterfree being the first, or for the third form of my first catch of the day, I think I got like 12 or 14. I'll have to check on that. But, yeah, a little tip. Um, it might be really well known. I who I don't know. I haven't heard anyone else talk about it. But it is something that I do, or try to do, to get a little extra Stardust here and there. Because as you can see, my Stardust is just like down there. Uh, I use it way too much. <laughs> so, just a little tip, trick, whatever you want to call it. If it's well known, well, I didn't know about it. I didn't hear anyone talk about it. But it's a little thing that I do. guys so I just went out through the drone got all those pretty sweet shots of the dark obviously I said sunset kind of didn't really happen but that's fine we got a bunch of really sweet like dark road shots so I'm um, gonna talk about Pokemon try a couple different things with some Pokemon stuff so hope you like that if not let me know but I wanted to touch on one more thing before this video is over this video is gonna be a little shorter 
Just a little video. Um, I wasn't planning on filming today. Then I got the urge to go shoot the, with the drone and all that stuff. So a little shorter video. Hope you guys enjoy it. Tomorrow, um, Emily and I are going to be going out and doing like raiding and like probably going downtown with Pokemon Go. And I'm going to probably get, let me rephrase that. I am going to get a bunch of cinematic shots and stuff like that. But I want to touch on one new piece of equipment I just got. It is another uh, gimbal. If you guys don't know what a gimbal is, I talked about it a little bit in my other videos where you can look it up. So I had a Came TV single with the added handlebars. Um, my like YouTube picture, my Instagram picture, and all that stuff has that in it. Um, it comes apart obviously because it's, it's, it's looks like that kind of. Obviously it's in two parts, but this is like the handle. This is the gimbal part with the motors and all that stuff. So. This was my old gimbal. I had a monitor attached to the bottom here. I'm gonna be selling that. And I just picked up for a crazy price um, from a friend, DJI Ronin, which is right here. I already have the Sony stabilized on there. Actually, here. We'll turn it on. All right, we are on. So we are moving. I have to adjust the motors a little bit. I don't know if you guys can hear this. A little bit of a hum. I think it's coming from this motor right here. Um, which I can adjust, but... There we are. Fancy little guy. I'm super excited. I don't know if you guys can tell. <laughs> I really liked... I'm going to turn this back off now. It also comes with a nice little stand. So if I turn this around, I can just pop it on like this. It's good to go, so I can kind of sit at places I was sitting on a table over here. But yes, I really enjoyed um, my old gimbal. I like the way it looked, I like the way it handled. My big problem with it that I didn't really think about when I bought it was the top handle, as you guys saw. This one, this one doesn't have a top handle. This is the way it's set up. This is what you get. Obviously, the camera sits in here, and you move around like this. Almost hit me in the face. It's obviously a lot lighter. Um, and like these, like I said before, aren't even a part of it initially. They bolt into the bottom. So all you really get is this handle here in the top. And I bought it for convenience, because I do show, shoot the uh, Sony Alpha series. Um, so it was a lot lighter, it could hold the camera better. Um, what the Ronin setup is just kind of like industry standard, I guess you would say. And the fact that like, obviously you don't need a Ronin to do it. Um, I know people that have the Cam TV equivalent, which works just as great. I literally just got the Ronin because I got it for like a hell of a deal. And I couldn't, I couldn't, could not not get it. <laughs> you ready for a lot of sweet shots with that? I can do a little bit more with like the top handle and everything and I'm just super excited. I am beyond pumped. That was what I really wanted to make this video about but then I also wanted to go fly the drone as you guys saw. I haven't flown this guy in a little while so I figured we fly it. You know, I've never flown it in the dark either so that was new. That's the end of the video. Um, like I said, I wasn't planning on filming today. I was just gonna film tomorrow. It's just a little special video for you guys. Hope you enjoy it. Be ready for like a lot of cinematics and some good rating for Pokemon Go tomorrow. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you are not already. And more videos to come. I've been slacking a little bit, I know. I've been very busy with other life things, mostly work guys don't know I do work full-time so I get videos out as much as possible so like subscribe like I said and I will check you guys in tomorrow's video see you then